Life is indeed darkness, except when there is urge. And all urge is blind, except when there is knowledge. And all knowledge is vain, except when there is work. Good morning. And all work is empty, except when there is love. And when you work with love, you bind yourself to yourself and to one another. Work is love made visible. My name is Ramiro Devaro Gomez. I'm an artist. My name is Kit Mazaris. I'm an artist and illustrator. My name is Den Burroughs, and I'm a director of Drip Down the Road and the uh, big RV driver as well. My name is Lauren Asta. I am full-time muralist, street artist. My name is Lisa Bolden, and I am a videographer, photographer, and editor. I'm Jonathan Neville. I'm one of the directors on Do the Road. I'm also an artist, and I enjoy creating. This is my dog, Yuki, and she's been on the road with us, and uh, she's the best little dog ever. Drop what I'm doing, I'm super shaggy. on the Road is a traveling artist residency. We travel for a month in an RV, painting murals and creating works on paper for a show. And that's different than a normal residency because in a normal residency you're usually stationary in one place for a period of time um, and more isolated. And this is really about seeing what happens when a bunch of artists live together 24-7 on the road where there's lots of unpredictable things and how they make work from those good and bad experiences. The work that I've been making here on this trip has been mural work and then a lot of works on paper. Yeah, the first time I've ever collaborated with artists. Um, it's been good, it's been hard, it's been wonderful. Here we go, day one. We started out intending to open a neighborhood bar that might have live music now and again and very quickly realized there was a huge need and niche for live music in this neighborhood and in the city in general for punk and metal and rock and roll. One of the main things I do is work with a lot of local bars and we just try to engage with people and try to do the grassroots type stuff. We like to support the struggling artists and we like to support the struggling musician and do what we can to try and build that and build a reputation for ourselves and for them. The project just sounded really amazing. It sounded like the perfect opportunity for us. We love expressing art in any way, shape, or form. Just a bunch of people in an RV just traveling. It's like a dream for artists. And it really, really puts you into a place where you have to go out and you have to be the best self that you can be. And it is really, really challenging, but it's a good challenge. And it's something that has made the best out of our artists and really pushed them. And I've seen some of my favorite work come out of what they're doing. Here, holding it down for free thinking, for a reality check, for humanity. I also live here with my dog, and I think that's part of the magic. You know, we're in an alley, that's also part of the magic. It just was, it had a similar energy. You know, it's a group of people on a mission. They're all there uh, for their own reason, and that's what the fridge is. that we get as artists we're just like we need to make money this is our craft this is our career and we need to make this profitable but when you see someone who's a lot younger and just wanting to just do it because they love it it's very refreshing and it stimulates you as well because you're just like let me get back to that doing because I love it rather than doing it because it's my job